I'm about to share with you two simple ways to build a very large messenger bot subscriber list very fast and for a very small investment. The beautiful thing about these two ways is that not only will you be building a messenger subscriber list, but you'll also be building an email list. So you'll be able to hit these people in two different places. So keep watching this video, be sure to hit that like button and let's go ahead and jump into it. So before I tell you the first way, I've gotta tell you about this magical place where you can go to learn how to build multiple messenger bots, Facebook ads, how to write sales copy, and how to sell stuff online. I'm talking about my free course. You can get access to my free digital marketing course by going to freebosslifestyle.com. After this video, it's gonna teach you a whole lot more than what I cover in this video. All right, so the first way is through a giveaway. Now I'm about to show you here soon the exact message flow of the giveaway to be able to to get their email as well as get them to share a post and get them to do multiple things. But first I just wanna say, when you're running this giveaway, you wanna make sure that whatever it is that you're giving away relates to your main product or service. You don't want it to be way out in left field, completely different than what you actually sell. You want it to either be what you exactly sell or something very similar. Now this can sometimes be hard, like digital products for some reason don't do too well as giveaways. Let's say you have a course or you have this digital product that's not tangible and you wanna be able to give that away, I would not recommend giving away something like that. I would recommend finding something that's complementary to that or something that's similar to that. Find a product or service that you can give them that they would like that is still somewhat related to your product or service because the main reason for this giveaway, one, is to definitely get some low cost subscribers and emails and things like that and get people looking at your brand and get their attention, but it's also to get people to raise their hand and say, hey, I'm interested in what it is that you have to offer. Ideally, the goal is everybody who enters this giveaway is a potential customer, right? So you wanna be able to sell them something down the line, but right now you're just getting your foot in the door and you're being able to shake their hand and say, hey, what's going on? My name is Ian, nice to meet you. Another thing, and this is probably the most important thing, is when you run ads, you gotta make sure that you are only targeting people that are higher income people. You don't wanna be targeting the sweepstakes people, the freebie hunters, the people that are just trying to get free stuff in life because that's gonna be pretty impossible to convert those free hunters into customers. So you want to, with your Facebook ads, with your Google ads, you really wanna make sure that you're targeting those people that have higher levels of income. I've ran a lot of these giveaway campaigns and in the very beginning when I was starting out, I was getting a whole lot of sweepstakes type people that are just trying to get something for free and it was extremely hard to then convert those sweepstakes cheapos into paying customers. One thing I forgot to mention about the giveaway is the value of it. You can't do a small value giveaway. If it's 50 bucks and you're trying to target people that make a high level of income, they're not gonna care about your small little $50 giveaway. It's not worth their time. So you gotta make the value of your giveaway be at least 300, 500 and up in order for the people that make high levels of income to actually want to take the time to actually enter your giveaway. So this is going to get you a lower cost per entrant on your giveaway campaign, as well as higher quality people entering your giveaway. All right, so now let's head over to the computer. Let's jump inside so I can actually show you what this message flow looks like of this giveaway, and I can show you what the Facebook ad targeting looks like, as well as some of the costs that you can know to expect when launching these giveaway campaigns. So before we jump into the computer, I wanted to let you know that if you leave a comment for me, I will reply. So if you have any questions about this at all, I will reply to your comments and we can chat it up in the comments section below. Also, if you're watching this on YouTube, be sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that little bell button right next to it because I'm constantly creating videos on a daily or every other day basis. You're gonna see a new video from me teaching you a little digital marketing hack. So now, let's jump into the computer. All right, so now we are in the computer, inside Minichat, and I'm gonna be showing you this giveaway flow that we have set up here. So it all starts with the JSON Grill Tool. Right here, this is the Grill Tool. They click on that Facebook button, on that ad, and it's gonna send them this message right here that says, ready to enter the Angel Care Baby Bundle Giveaway. They're gonna click yes, it's gonna tag them, and then they're gonna be entering into this flow right here. Now the reason why we have them tagged, being tagged, is because we get a whole 
whole bunch of subscribers in this and we want to be able to segment out just the people who entered into this giveaway and then when we announce the winner we're just going to send it to that small segment so they enter in through there at this point we have them as a messenger subscriber we say great the bundle is valued at x amount now if you didn't know this is actually a messenger bot template that we have for sale on our website if you want to go ahead and purchase this many chat template there's going to be a link in the description basically you go to evolvemedia.agency and then shop through all of our different templates this one is called the giveaway promo 3 or you can get the ultimate giveaway promo they're both pretty awesome they got a lot of information in there so here's the giveaway right here uh, we tell them the value of the giveaway now you definitely want to make sure that it's a high value and that you actually tell them the value because that's gonna you know be able to express wow this is such a big deal you know then they're gonna click on yes um, would you like an additional entry for giving us your email address they're gonna click yes because 88 percent of the people are clicking yes look you can see it right there then we're grabbing their email address looks like so far we have 715 email addresses and then we're gonna say hey do you want to share this with your buddies and get another entry into this giveaway so then they're gonna click sure I'll share it looks like 53% uh, of them are saying sure I'll share it and then it gets sent over to you know give them the link to join the Facebook group as well as share the post that they originally saw as the Facebook ad so this is giving us even more organic reach It's getting us even better ad performance because they're sharing that post it's got a whole bunch of engagement on that ad and then we're also getting them into our Facebook group so we're telling them hey we got this incredible Facebook group that you should join if you're an expecting mother so click on this button right here go join the group and we're getting group members so we're building multiple assets messenger bot subscribers email email list subscribers, Facebook groups, and we're getting them to share the post, getting them to engage with the page, getting them into custom audiences. I guess they were already in the custom audience anyway. So that is a brief run through of the giveaway message flow that we have. Again, if you wanna get this, this actual giveaway template, link is in the description, as well as if you just go to evolvemedia.agency, you can get that. So now let me show you what kind of data we are seeing on the Facebook ad side. Okay, so we're here inside the ads manager and this is just showing this month of April, 2019. Just this month, we have spent $444 on the giveaway campaign. Now Facebook is actually saying 806 people that have messaged the page from the actual Facebook ad. But if we go to ManyChat and we look at how many people actually entered this, it's 831. So that means we've gotten about 30 people that have just entered this for free because they've seen the shared post or they, you know, with the engagement, it showed up in their newsfeed. So we got about 30 people that Facebook is actually not saying that they actually did. So that's pretty cool. Now, right now, Facebook is saying about 55 cents cost per message. The reason why that's higher than what I normally would expect, usually what I would expect is around the 30 to 40 cents cost per message is because with this campaign, I'm targeting higher income people. So if we look at the actual ads level, I am targeting people that are income related, they are shoppers, I'm kind of targeting the more premium audiences that Facebook has. So I'm targeting expensive taste, first class travel, BMW, luxury, they're also into the pregnancy stuff, the expecting mothers that we're trying to get into the group, into this messenger list, all that kind of stuff. And then we're also excluding out those lower income type of audiences. So we're excluding out free stuff, people that like free products, buy one, get one free, discounts and allowances, dollar stores, family dollar, Dollar Tree, sweepstakes. We're excluding out all those people because we only want the cream of the crop. We only want the, the people that spend money, shop online, and have a higher income. So because of that targeting, that is giving us a little bit higher of a cost per result. Now I just launched these ads like yesterday or this last weekend or something. So I optimized things and I got the cost down to around the 30 cent mark. And even though we are still targeting those higher income people, somehow I'm getting the cost at around 36 cents, 31 cents. So that's pretty cool. But you know, overall it's averaging 55 cents so far with the $444 spend. So in the beginning of this video, when I said you could get a whole lot of subscribers for a small investment, that is what I mean, $444 to get about 830 messenger bot subscribers. In my opinion, I'm pretty happy with those numbers because I know that I can make 
500, 1000, I can make that money back easily on selling these people products. Now just to show you what the ad looks like and how all the social proof is being gathered on one ad, here is that ad right here. Now it's showing the entire bundle, right? We got 318 shares, 170 likes, and in this message we're saying, look, the value of this bundle is 340 bucks and we're gonna be announcing the winner May 3rd. So this is not an evergreen giveaway that's just constantly going. This is like a launch the giveaway, run it for a couple weeks, announce the winner on May 3rd, get all those winners into the Facebook group and then once we have announced the winner and the giveaway is all closed, then we can start hitting them with offers, hitting them with things to buy. Because what we found in the past is if we just get them to enter the giveaway, it's for some reason they just don't want to buy while the giveaway process is still out there. We got to actually close the giveaway, show them that we announced the winner, send the product over to the winner, have the winner post the product bundle in the group showing that they won. That way these people don't look at our brand like we're just sketchy, we're just running fake giveaways and not giving away anything. We wanna show them, look, we told you we were running a giveaway, we picked a winner, we actually gave them the stuff, they received their product, case closed, now buy this product and buy this product. Hey, check out this cool special offer that we're running. <laughs> that's, that's the whole objective of this giveaway campaign. Now the second way is very similar to the first way, but if you don't wanna run a giveaway, then you can just do it with a lead magnet or you can give away something for free to everybody. You wanna create a free digital product, preferably a video series or maybe it's a video and a PDF download, but it's all digital and you wanna have a lot of value. So a lot of information is covered, a lot of stuff they're gonna learn in this massive digital product is gonna be in this course, right? So you have this, this mini course, or maybe it's a full out course, and you put this course inside a program like ClickFunnels. You build up the messenger dashboard and you put it in a software like ClickFunnels where they have to create their account. And when they create their account, they're gonna be giving you their email address, right? So in that creation process, they're giving you their email address and then they're having access to all of this free digital content inside of there. And then your process for actually raising awareness and running ads and telling everybody about this free digital download is a Facebook ad connected to a messenger bot. So your Facebook ad then says, want to get access to this high value thing that we have for free? Click the button below. We're going to send you a message in Messenger with an exclusive link to where you can go create your account for free. You see, typically we sell this thing for $500, but we need to send you an exclusive private link so that you can then go create your account and have access for free. So in that process, when they click on that Facebook ad, they're gonna be sent that message, they're gonna engage with your Messenger bot, and then they're gonna be a Messenger subscriber, and then you're, you're gonna link them over to where they can go and create their account, putting in their email address, to then have access to all that digital content. So you're building two assets at once, Messenger and email, as they consume that digital product that you gave them for free, they're gonna be building the relationship with your brand, and then when you upsell them on other stuff, they're more likely to actually take that upsell because they trust you, they like you, they're familiar with you, and everything like that. So those are my two ways to building a large messenger subscriber list for a small investment. Hope you liked this video. Be sure to hit that like button below. Leave a comment if you have any questions for me. And if you're watching this on YouTube, then be sure to hit that subscribe button and the little bell next to it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.